Well, joining us now is Sister Terry Ricard, is the President and Executive Director of Renew International. And thank you so much for being here. It's great to be back talking with you, Kevin. Yeah. And it's a big, big year. Uh, and uh, first of all, can you believe it's been 40 years? No, I can't <laughs> believe it. People say, were well, you there? I said, no, thank you. I wasn't there in the beginning. But yeah, it's a great uh, anniversary for us. And we're saying forward at 40. Oh, all right. Very clever. Yes. <laughs> But it's great. Uh, it, talk a little bit about the, the kickoff. I know you honored uh, some very special people uh, to start things off for the 40th anniversary. So to start it off, we uh, honored uh, Archbishop O'Malley from the Archdiocese of Boston. Uh, he was instrumental in bringing us um, to the Archdiocese. And actually, we partnered with the diocese to launch Arise Together in Christ. Uh, 30,000 people participated in seven languages in the Archdiocese, and now we've been in the last eight years in 50 dioceses with the Rise. So we're really grateful to him and Miriam McLaughlin and all the people that were the pastors and great folks that worked with us. So we're honoring him. Then they moved to Why Catholic, Journey Through the Catechism, to keep the small groups going for ongoing formation. Uh, we also honored Bishop DiMarzio from a native of Newark, New Jersey, <laughs> uh, Bishop of Brooklyn and Queens. And he's currently uh, doing Rise Together in Christ with diverse uh, ethnic groups, different languages, and we have over 10,000 people participating. So he's a great uh, champion for evangelization. And then the last two bishops are from the great Diocese of San Angelo, Texas, a mission diocese. Um, we began with Bishop Pfeiffer, I think, 15 years ago, and we have worked continuously with that diocese, uh, starting with Renew for the 21st Century, Arise, Why Catholic, uh, and everything, of course, in Spanish. And uh, currently with Bishop Sis, we launched our newest process, Be My Witness, actually piloted it there. So both Bishop Pfeiffer and now Bishop Sis are champions for evangelization and partners with Renew. So it was a great celebration. Yeah, and this great relationship, too, has continued to grow. Mm -hmm. um, I know you have um, other things planned for the upcoming uh, yes. year as well, a symposium that you're going to be having and the gala, too. Could you talk about those? Yeah, I think for, for me, anyway, the symposium is the highlight because it's on pastoral renewal, parish renewal, named after our two parish priests that started uh, Renew, founded it, Monsignor Kleisler and Monsignor Tom Ivory. So they're still alive. Um, talk to both of them pretty regularly, excited about the anniversary. And it was a dream uh, come true for them. Um, so we're honoring them and their great pastoral leadership and vision. So um, it's happening at Seton Hall University within our own Archdiocese of Newark. They're a co-sponsor. Uh, we also are co-sponsored by America Media. So we're hoping for an event that can be for the people gathered there, but also live streamed. And we have a great uh, speakers, uh, William Simon from Parish Catalyst, um, a, a priest from uh, Newark who um, has launched one, Be My Witness, and uh, Father Bismarck from the Inner City, uh, Lisa Anzingler, uh, Chris Lowney, who is uh, a champion for leadership just wrote a book recently, Everyone Leads. Uh, he's fabulous, and myself. <laughs> <laughs> so it should be a great event. And then Cardinal Tobin will be uh, preaching at evening prayer. That's how we'll end the event. So. And then a uh, culmination of the, the big gala coming up in, in June, and uh, mm -hmm. your, your, your hopes for that is it should be a great celebration. Yeah, fabulous celebration uh, in West Orange, New Jersey. We have a, a number of honorees, but I think for me, we, we have this award called the Monsignor Kleiser Award. It's named after our founder, and we are honoring the three founding mothers of Renew. On the 25th anniversary, we honored Father Kleisler and Father Tom Ivory. So now three significant women, women which have been huge in Renew's history, um, two sisters and a laywoman. So we're really, and then some great business leaders who've uh, less quick and um, both of them just great guys who've supported Renew. 
So when you look back at the many years, I know you weren't there at the start, but <laughs> uh, what's it like for you to, to see the growth that, that you've participated mm -hmm. in and, and, and continue to see as, it, as you head into the future? Yeah. You know, I think what's exciting about Renew is that we continually evolve. So uh, Father Tom Kleisel in particular is an entrepreneur and uh, tremendous commitment to the mission of the church. And I think we've tried to keep that up, you know, keep our ear to the ground. And what does the church need today? So we've continued to meet those needs. Uh, I think our latest is Be My Witness, tremendous way to change the culture of the parish. And what we're trying to do now is look at marriage preparation, baptism preparation, through the eyes of evangelization, so we can reach out to this uh, millennials uh, in a new way, through new media. So we're always trying to what does the church need now, and how can we meet that need? That's great. Well, thank you so much, Sister Sherry, for being with us. Renew Very International. Welcome. If people want to find out more, I'm sure they can go to the website, right? Yep, www.renewintl.org. Excellent. <laughs> thank you. Congratulations. Uh, Very welcome. Thank you.